And for me, it's a really, really important workshop because... Bradford City's under-18 and under-23 players were given the chance to increase their knowledge of cardiac health with an LFE life skills session delivered by Toby Alabi, founder of the Heart for More Foundation. So the session today was teaching the boys about cardiac health, general cardiac health and football related cardiac health. So we're talking about signs and symptoms associated with having a potential um, heart problem or someone that's going into cardiac arrest. We also um, taught the boys how to perform CPR, how to use a defibrillator as well, which are key life saving skills. Um, the session itself actually derives from my personal experience. Um, as many people know, I, I used to play professionally myself, but I had a cardiac arrest at age 19, which is why I set up the charity, um, and also which is why I run this workshop with LFE, Premier League and, and PFA. Alabi is a graduate of Millwall's Academy, and now spreads awareness to apprentices across the country after having his playing career ended abruptly. I think it's, it's of massive importance. I think every club that we visit for the first time, we realise how little the, the boys know about these um, issues and also how little they know about the, the skills that can save a life. I think the key take-homes for me from the session are, first and foremost, knowing and understanding signs and symptoms, how to identify them and how to respond to them, um, utilising the life-saving skills that we've taught them. It's my opportunity to, to give a bit of advice to, to the boys from someone who's been in that position and someone who can now no longer um, play the game of football. Um, it's just f for them to hear it from an unfamiliar mouth, to say that, listen, the opportunity is massive and it's one that shouldn't be taken for granted because whether you play for 15 years or, like I said to them, whether you play for 15 months, the career is a short one and something has to come after it. The session also encouraged the Bantams youngsters to reflect on life after football and reinforce the importance of working hard in the classroom. This, this is really important, um, not just for football, but just for life in general. And if you're out and about with anyone and you just, you just see someone down on the floor and like unresponsive, you obviously want to go help and um, yeah, do it. that sort of uh, session would, would really be helpful. Obviously, you've got, got to keep an eye on your college work and stuff like that and always have um, different doors open for different opportunities. So um, have, having that session were a bit of an eye-opener to say um, it's not all tunnel vision really and you've got to keep your options open. Take out the pads from the bottom of the device. A lot of it was about obviously footballers and uh, in this industry of how many people do have a cardiac arrest. And um, the figures were astonishing. I didn't realise. I couldn't even think of a couple off the top of my head that have died. Listening to Toby's story and, and how much he said to just treasure the moment of what we've got, and that's kind of made me realise what we've got even more. Um, obviously, unfortunate for him to be cut short, but we're still here, so we've got to make the most of it. The Heart for More workshop is one of many provided by LFE's Life Skills programme, which is now open to players from under 9s to the under 23s, covering a wide range of important topics. It's very forward thinking to support an initiative um, like the Foundations. So I'd say that LFE along with the PFA and the Premier League, all three of them have been very pioneering in the work that we've started to do. I think the fact that the LFE have introduced the um, tiered programme from 14s, 15s, 16s, 18s and 23s is it's of massive importance because not everybody in the school by age is going to get to the youth team or the 23 to be able to experience the workshops that are being provided. So I think having the foresight to see that it's worth investing in the schoolboys and giving them life skills is, is also very important.